and everyone around you is a demon belittling others. You look like trash. You look like fucking trash. It all comes crumbling down at some point. Like I've tried to explain to people about bushfires and everything that they're necessary for the world to recuperate because we have to kill off those things that are toxic. So, well, right before they snap, right before they do certain things, right before all this and that, because of all the trauma, you're a dumb piece of shit, but I'm spoiled. And I don't give a shit if I'm spoiled or not, because today is not the fucking day for Letitia Collins. But I wanted to cut her. I was like, you bitch, back the fuck up, I will cut you. Keep your opinions to your fucking selves. I am keeping myself alive. It is terrible because I wonder what the fuck his fucking brain's gonna come out looking like because I'm like, oh my Jesus, what have I done? And imagine what the fuck my mother went through to try to kill me all. And no wonder I'm fucked up and crazy. Anyway, I'm pissed off right now. I need money. I need There's a difference between wanting and needing, but it's a strangulation. Wanting to strangle my belts and wanting to strangle individuals. Because if this baby, if I have to at some point go give birth in the woods, nobody's gonna ever trace it back to me. There's not gonna be any fucking trace or tracking of anything, of any kind. So, uh, there's, but then all of a sudden it's just like I snap. <laughs> I'm kind of sadistic. <laughs> I kind of enjoy that. Shit, I've gone through all kinds of stuff. I went through an abortion I thought I could never get over. Like, I literally was haunted for years. Years haunted. And, um, yeah.